the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. I can't wait for I Quit. Him versus AJ Styles later on today. I cannot wait. Cody Rhodes, we're finally getting away from the finish the story thing, which I'm glad we are because I really want him to be such a great WWE Champion. And right now, he's killing it. So. And I'm so happy AJ Styles and him are feuding. What do you want to talk about? A few weeks ago, what do you want to talk about? I actually thought that AJ Styles would retire. Any of us? No, we all thought it was going to happen. I actually fell for it, believe it or not. Be that guy, that guy who overstays his welcome, that guy that just needs one more match, one more run. Unfortunately, AJ. You're starting to look like that guy. I really do hope, though, moving forward, even after this feud, they keep the good brothers with AJ. Man, the international crowds, oh boy, they, they, deserve, they deserve the PLEs more than we do, honestly, in the U.S., This is awesome. Dude, Cody can't even talk. <laughs> Cody is for the people. He's the people's champ in 2024. AJ Styles, though, he has been given the task, the impossible task of making me say the words. I quit. I love when the stipulations actually, like, matter. And in this case, like, it makes the most sense to have an I Quit match. Because of the whole fake retirement thing. Oh, here comes AJ Styles. In the Good Brothers. Let's never separate the Good Brothers from AJ Styles ever again, please. Hey, now that WWE is hiring a bunch of former Bullet Club members, oh man, we need to get our own WWE Bullet Club at this point. Too sweet, baby, too sweet. Wow, Cody. AJ Styles is fucking built different in 2024, that's for sure. You're really worked up about this, aren't you? It's kind of funny. It was really that easy. To get you this worked up. It's crazy to see this amount of people for a SmackDown episode. And you lose your pool. Man, I don't even know what they're saying, but it's so cool. It's so cool to see the crowd like being this crazy throughout the entire night. And I can't imagine how the crowd's gonna be for Clash later on. Which we will be doing a live watch along for. So if you are looking for somebody to watch the show with, and you're watching this very, right when it comes out, we will be live. I thought we were supposed to have a little conversation. So why don't you leave Horace and Jasper behind and get in this ring and face me man to man. They've done such a good job with this feud here. I'm more excited going into the I Quit match than I am for Drew versus Damian. Like, I just really wasn't a fan of the build-up for it. I feel like it's going to be a great match, but... Man, there was no chemistry there when it came to the storytelling. Oh, wow, they got the live and loud sound. I love that. Can they get to a hundred? 
Ooh, they're at 92. Up 94, I think. Up 95. Come on, get to 100. Holy shit. That was cool with the, with the sound, like, seeing, like, how loud they are. That's so cool. I think the Kansas City Chiefs do that in the NFL. I could be wrong. Man, this is, I wish I was in this crowd right now. They look like they're having so much fun. We are nothing alike, you know that, right? Let me remind you and everyone else that it took me 17 years to climb the ladder to get to WWE. 17 years, yep. I remember watching AJ Styles and good old TNA. But when it got tough, what you do, Cody? You quit the WWE. Damn. Oh, you didn't like that? I got news for you. He also quit New Japan Pro Wrestling. You left New Japan Pro Wrestling. Don't stop there. <laughs> you quit Ring of Honor. This man right here. Uh, oh <laughs> damn you don't even have to mention AEW and you know what he's talking about sheesh started up your own company and you quit that too Cody Rhodes gets going Damn, AJ's low-key cooking right now. Even though he left Ring of Honor too. AJ, and left TNA. I have made some big decisions in my career. I walked away. Come on, AJ, you're the bad guy. Tell these freaking fans to shut the fuck up. I walked away from WWE, I walked away from New Japan, I walked away from Ring of Honor. My buddies and I started somewhere else and I walked away there too. The truth is, I have never been afraid... I feel like they're not to allowed to mention AEW. To something greater. I did not quit. Yeah, they're never going to mention the word AEW, I can I tell. I did not quit. Instead, I bet on myself that I was something more. I gambled on myself, and AJ, I was right. Yep. If I had quit, I would not be standing here holding the North Star of the WWE, the most important title in the entire game. I would not be standing here, WWE champion. That's my champion right there. That's my champion. That I idolized my entire career. Cody freaking Rhodes. Honorable. If anybody quit, you quit on yourself. Because what did it take to get a WWE Championship rematch? You had to pretend to be Mark Henry for a night, huh? Oh! <laughs> if anything, the phenomenal one. Damn. A resentful coward. And that is a bitter pill to swallow. But I have no problem yes. shoving that pill down your throat and making you say the words, I quit. Wow. This right here is how you sell a fucking pay-per-view or a PLE. I quit. It's natural. Where is this passion with Damien and Drew? Phenomenal. Man, this this feud. I hope it continues after. I can I can say I can go through freaking more PLEs with AJ and Cody. This is great. But I feel like this would be the last match with AJ and Cody. They're not going to do three matches. But I hope it. I hope whatever happens. AJ Styles, his career he furthers. Because when he's in this position, this is where he strives. 
He needs to be in like the big picture. I'm not saying it's gonna be easy, Cody. It's not. I saw you in Hell in Cell against Seth Rollins with a torn peck. You didn't quit. I realize that. I just hope that Cody doesn't get injured in this match in later on. Seth Rollins. You're gonna be in the ring with a phenomenal AJ Styles. And I am gonna do whatever it takes to get that WWE Championship. And if that means beating you to a bloody pulp, tearing you to pieces, whatever it is I gotta do to beat you so badly. Honestly, I got a quick predi prediction. Gift to you. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I have a feeling Cody's going to get color today. And like it's not even going to be like accidental. I think like he's going to get legitimate color. Look at the eyes of AJ Styles, Wade. That's not a man. And then the people in Scotland, they are in for something really good tonight. But loved it. That was a great promo. Both of them looked really good and honestly Finally, like a stipulation, it actually makes sense. And there's real animosity there, so I love that.